Hello friends. In this session, I will explain about the subject of thermodynamics. What are the syllabus of the thermodynamics for your GATE paper, GATE 2020 we are discussing and how to prepare the thermodynamics for the GATE, which books you have to refer and what are the what are the various tricks to solve for the to go for the thermodynamics let us start with the first syllabus of the thermodynamics during my session i'll cover the thermodynamics we'll start from the basic introduction part of the thermodynamics introduction part of the thermodynamics in which i'll cover some of the important properties of the thermodynamics what are the various forms various types of system open system closed system isolated system what do we mean by state of a system what do we mean by properties of a system what is the phase rule we all go with this some of the introduction part right after this introduction part we'll go with the first law of thermodynamics sorry we'll start with the zeroth law of thermodynamics this is the syllabus this is the order in which i will teach zeroth law of thermodynamics in which we will study what, is, what do we mean by the zeroth law, concept of temperature, various types of thermometer which we have and so on. After the zeroth law of thermodynamics, we will go with the chapter heat and work interaction. Heat and work interaction. Right. In this heat and work interaction, we will see that what do we mean by thermodynamic work? What do we mean by heat transfer? How the heat transfer will take place? What is the various uh, formula of the work done for open system or for closed system for various process like isothermal process, adiabatic process or your uh, polytropic process, constant volume process, constant pressure process. What are the various assumptions of each of the formula? In thermodynamics, the formula is known to the each and every student if I say that formula is not that much important. But in thermodynamics, if you are good with the assumptions that which assumption you have to take while applying a, a formula, then you will get uh, to solve this thermodynamics with 100% success rate, right? Otherwise, thermodynamics questions are not difficult, but how to use the formulas of thermodynamics is the difficult part because you have to remember all these assumptions. So during my sessions, I'll, I'll elaborate all the assumptions and I'll speak each and every time all the assumptions which we have to use for the various formulas. So in the heat and work interaction we will see all these topic what is the heat transfer what is the work transfer. After this we will go for the first law of thermodynamics. First law of thermodynamics first for the closed system and after that we will go with the open system. First law of thermodynamics for the for the closed system we will see what are the relation between heat transfer, work transfer and your internal energy and how to go for the problems. After that we will go for the steady flow energy equation for the open system and unsteady flow energy equation for the open system. So for the gate paper if I say that then this heat work interaction and first law of thermodynamics questions will come frequently in the gate paper. After covering this first law of thermodynamics for both first uh, for both closed and the open system, we'll go with the second law of thermodynamics. Second law of thermodynamics. In second law of thermodynamics, we will deal with the heat pump, heat engines, refrigerator. What is the direction of the process? How the process will take place in a particular direction? What is the condition of it? Right. What is the, you can say, Clausius statement we have to see. What is the Clausius inequality? How the Clausius inequality will be applicable to the question? How you can approach to the problems? We will discuss in the second law of thermodynamics. What do we mean by the second law efficiency? We have to discuss in the second law of thermodynamics. In the continuation of second law of thermodynamics, we will enter into the chapter, the most important chapter for the gate, if I say, is the entropy. This is the most important chapter but most difficult chapter to understand right so many no so many students will face the problem in understanding this subject uh, this chapter entropy how the entropy they cannot visualize what is the entropy what is the meaning of the entropy what is the meaning of increase of entropy 
right how to write the equations of entropy right they will they will be confused right if you if you study well during my session for the entropy i am explaining the entropy from the very scratch uh, from the very scratch and will explain that how you can visualize the entropy what is the real meaning of entropy and we will also explain that what is the entropy for a reversible process for a irreversible process how the entropy change will takes place how you can write the equations of entropy change what is the entropy generation how you can visualize the entropy generation right what is the uh, what is the entropy generation for the flow system also we can all all discuss in detail in this chapter entropy from the entropy we will go for the chapter availability availability or available energy or exergy right in this we will see what is the maximum amount of useful work which we can get what do we mean by the available energy what do we mean by the unavailable energy right what is the irreversibility associated with the system and we also deal we also see the availability balance of a open system and availability balance of a closed system right how the energy will degrade during its flow we all discuss in this and the irreversibility associated with it after that we will go with the properties of pure substance properties of pure substance in which we will deal with the phase diagrams phase diagrams pressure temperature diagram volume temperature diagram pressure volume diagram how they can form what is the physical significance of those saturated lines how the saturated lines will why the saturated lines will be inclined in right direction or the left direction what is the meaning of the saturated curve how to use the formula of your uh, in the saturation curve what is the what is your can say heat transfer during a phase change all these thing we will discuss in this properties of pure substance after that we will go with the properties of ideal gas properties of ideal gas in which we will discuss what is the ideal gas ideal gas equation then when we have to consider what is the condition for the ideal gas if there is a deviation from the ideal gas then what do we mean by the van der waal gas equation what are the various constants in the van der waal gas equation and so on we will study in this properties of ideal gas the last chapter of your syllabus will be thermodynamic relations thermodynamic relations this is more or less mathematical this is more or less mathematical chapter right in this mathematics is involved rather than your thermodynamics so this will be the syllabus of the thermodynamics we will cover each and everything in detail if i mark the important chapter for the gate point of view if i mark then this second law of thermodynamics entropy and availability these three topics i marked important for the gate these three topics i marked for the important for the gate and if question come then high probability will be there that question will come from these three chapters because in these three chapters you need all the concepts to be very clear then only you can able to solve the numerical on these three chapters right we will discuss with it during our session we will more focus on the conventional type problems right see gate is a objective type objective paper but i am more focusing on the conventional type problem because if you are able to understand those big problems those conventional type problems then the objective type problems can be easily solved right so we are more focused on the conventional type problems so that your concepts will be good that command of your your command on that concept must be good so then only you can solve the objective type question right we will also picked some of the good questions which they asked in the previous year of gate we will solve those questions also and this will be the syllabus if i if i see the weightage of the thermodynamics in the gate paper then more or less 3 to 4 marks paper 3 to more 4 marks question will come in the thermodynamics 3 to 4 marks is the weightage in the thermodynamics and it's a very easy and very scoring subject of your gate if we talk about how to prepare for the thermodynamics just you need to cover all the syllabus all the videos which we posted on our website you have to cover each and every video right we already in we already included some of the good questions in those videos 
After that, you have to do the previous year questions. The previous year questions which they asked in the gate. Previous year questions. Right. This previous question, year questions are on our website. If you see, if you check our website, that is www.gatevidya.com. All the previous year questions subject wise is there. Topic wise, previous year questions are segregated with the complete solution. Right. Those are available on our website. That is also free of cost. You can easily access the all the previous year questions from our website. You have to solve this. Right. Don't do the one thing that what is the problem or you can say what is the common tendency of a student while going with the online classes is that this complete syllabus will be available with you from the day one when you get the access this complete syllabus will be available with you generally what the student will do they will complete all the videos and then they will go for the questions don't do this my suggestion is my personal suggestion is First of all, cover one one topic. Let us say if you cover this heat and work interaction from the videos, then solve all the questions of work and heat and work interaction. Previous year questions, any other questions, any other standard book which you have. Suppose for if I suggest then P K Nag is the best book for the P K Nag is the best book for the thermodynamics if I suggest. So if you cover this heat and work interaction videos, then you have immediately solved first previous year questions so that you will get some you will gain some confidence. Then solve PK NAG. Right. PK NAG unsolved question you have to solve. Right. So don't do this that first cover all the syllabus, then go for PK NAG. Then once you reach this thermodynamic relation, you will forget this heat and work interaction. That is not useful for you. Right. So my suggestion is to took one chapter complete it and solve the numericals which are available with you of that chapter that would be good so this is the way you can complete cover the thermodynamics right so and this will be the only syllabus as per the latest syllabus i write here this will be the syllabus of the thermodynamics we will cover each and every topic in detail and best book will be the p genag only some practice questions will also be available to you we will also provide some of the practice questions which include both objective type and your conventional type we will provide all the objective uh, some practice question for you so that you will gain get some new questions to solve for it